What is going on guys, it's your boy MGQ Gaming here and today I'm bringing you yet another play review. I'm smashing these out of my channel at the moment and I'm really enjoying doing it. So in this episode we're going to be reviewing Team of the Season, Bella Rabi. So this card looks absolutely incredible and I am I was buzzing to use it at the moment of recording. His stats, 94 pace and 87 dribbling looked amazing. But this is a squad we used him in. Uh, it was a really nice looking squad. He only cost 60,500 and in the four games we played with him he scored four goals. He's got four star weak foot, no, three star weak foot, four star skill moves. He's right footed with medium low work rates and he is six foot tall. He's only 25 as well uh, which makes him pretty young. But the Belly Rabbit card does have 94 pace and 87 dribbling which is what we were focusing on. 92 acceleration, 90 agility, 83 balance, 82 jump speed, 82 jumping and 95 sprint speed uh, were the main ones there. 85 ball control, 87 dribbling, he's got 88 shot power which was incredible um, to use as well. He had really powerful shots when I did in fact use him. Um, but he did have quite a few at the bottom, 88 and stuff as well, but medium roll work rates didn't look the best. Right mid, right wing and roll it in centre forward, you could use him in and he had no special traits which was kind of annoying. Um, but the thing I did like about this card was uh, he, was he felt really, it was weird to kind of uh, see, he, ne he never really get pushed off the ball that often, he kind of just kept it, even when he get tackled, he still kind of uh, stayed with the ball, which was always a good thing to see, his balance is really good, uh, and yeah, I really enjoyed using his balance, but as you can see, he was quite nice at finishing as well, he finished off a lot of the chances he had, um, and was really good at passing, which including which includes like crossing and stuff like that um, as well, he did score a few nice goals for us, like this one uh, where he just kind of finished it off nicely into the corner, the reason I put pace um, not so much as you'll see in a wee while, is that it wasn't as fast as you'd suspect, it wasn't 94, um, and that's the thing that kind of annoys me about it, it didn't seem 94, it seemed maybe late 80s, uh, maybe 90 if you're lucky, but it did not seem 90. A4. Also his dribbling, I didn't enjoy his dribbling terribly much, I felt like it was a bit, it, it didn't even feel like it got to 80 sometimes, which was annoying, but um, he wasn't terrible but it wasn't what I would expect when he has 87 dribbling as you can see his pace there getting through there unfortunately didn't finish that one off but his pace was really nice to use not as fast as I thought but still really fast he had a good opportunity here to finish this one off and he did that superbly his finishing was probably the best thing about this card he was great at finishing and finished most of the chances that he did in fact get so here is another chance here where he did in fact run through nice uh, dribbling there probably one of the only times when you do kind of close in your feet dribbling that is the times where he is good at dribbling great pass there and unlucky from him but the positives i found of this card are his finishing his balance his passing and his pace you notice all of them in game maybe not space so much but the rest you notice a lot and um, the negatives were his strength he did seem to not be as strong as I assumed he would be, but his balance did help him out a bit of that, but I, he did get muscled off the ball a few times, which is kind of annoying. His dribbling wasn't as good as I thought, as I said, and he always tended to stay back a bit as well, which is kind of annoying. But anyway guys, I am going to be giving Team of the Season Bella Rabbi an 8 out of 10. I did enjoy his card, but it wasn't the best card that I have used um, so far out of the Team of the Seasons ones. Probably the best one has been probably Nolito, um, which he was a really good card. But anyway guys, if you can smash the like button, 15 likes would be absolutely incredible for this video. Subscribe if you're new to the channel as well. And yeah, it's been your boy MJQ Gaming here. Bye bye.